Okay, secondly, um, the main point of this video is we're looking at the actual calorie type stuff. So, when it comes down to calories, it, 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 in theory, in the most layman terms, it does not matter what calories, uh, what you eat to, con to, to consume your calories, okay, um, as long as you are hitting the amount of calories your body needs for the, um, the, eff the effect it's in at the moment, okay, so if you are the average person, okay, and, and I'm making these numbers up and we're saying 2,000 calories a day, okay, it doesn't matter in theory if you consumed 2,000 calories of chocolate cake or 2,000 calories of chicken, broccoli, and, uh, and rice, okay. Um, like I said, this is the most simplistic terms, okay, so we're basically, you, you've got to consume uh, less calories than your body expends. It, it, it's as simple as that, okay? So if we eat more calories, if, if, if our body takes 2,000 calories for day-to-day -day what we do, okay, we need to consume either that to maintain weight, okay, or we reduce it and we will start to lose weight. The opposite is, is obviously if you want to gain weight, okay? We need 2,000 calories to just float around on our daily maintenance, okay? If we need to put on weight, we need, need to be consuming more calories, okay? Uh, it's as simple as that guys, the calories you consume are your energy, okay, and your body needs that energy, but once it's used what it needs, okay, it's going to store it as a fat, okay, in the most simplistic terms. Um, what you do day to day, okay, going to work, walking up the, the, the stairs to the train station, um, going to the gym, walking to meet your friends for lunch, okay, we're burning calories, okay, even just sitting at your desk, you're burning a certain amount of calories, okay. And like I said, we're using roughly, we're just making up the number of a, a, a 2,000 calories. Okay, so if, you, if your main goal is to lose weight, okay, and you either have, have lost weight and then plateaued, okay, um, your weight loss has stopped, or you, you're starting to, to, to try and lose weight and it's not happening, okay, there's, there's two simple, simple things you can do. Anyone can do it. You do not need to go and employ a personal trainer straight away. Okay, um, you don't need uh, any magic uh, guru advice or, or, or anything like that. Okay, you need to either, there's two principles, okay. Either one, you need to reduce the amount of calories you're consuming. Okay, or two, you need to start moving more. Okay? So if you are um, one of these lazy type of people who sit on a sofa all day, um, and if you take offence to me saying that you're probably one of those type of people, okay, you need to get moving more. And if you are one of those people that sit on the sofa all day, I'm looking at my sofa there, um, it doesn't mean you have to go, then go straight to the gym five times a week, okay? That can mean instead of driving to pick the kids up from school, okay, for that, for that five minute drive, take a 20 minute walk. Or um, take the dog for a walk, things like that, okay? You, you just move in more, you just need to move more. Um, if you are one of these people that comes to the gym five times a week and, and joins in all the classes or, you, or you've got a training program and your weight loss stalls, you're probably looking more at reducing those calories slightly or if you can in, in your program, it's start exercising more, okay? It, it, it's training that bit harder or look at switching up the, the type of exercises to shock the body a bit. Um, it, it, it's as simple as that, guys, okay? Most people, okay, and I wrote a post on Facebook about it, most people um, are not really accountable for the amount of calories they consume, okay? If I, if I asked you all at 8 o'clock this evening to sit down and write down what you've eaten today, you will forget some of the things, okay? Na consciously, um, we don't remember picking up a, a, a biscuit from the fridge at work or... Um, having a swig of a can of coke, etc. all things like that. Okay, the main meals, we know, we remember what we've had for breakfast, what we've had for lunch, what we've had for dinner, okay, but the snack side of stuff, that's where most people go wrong, and the fluid intake, okay. Um, top tip, all right, just grab, uh, everyone's got an iPhone nowadays, okay, or, or a smartphone, okay, every time you consume something, while you're eating something, or drinking something, just tap it in the notes, okay. 
Then start to have a look at a bit of a pattern about the amount of food you're actually eating. And be honest with how hard you're training as well. Okay, do you train as hard as what you could do? Okay, um, that doesn't mean if you're new to training that you're not training as hard as someone that's been training for 10 years. I just mean, are you giving what you can give while you're training? Okay, are you burning the most amount of calories you can um, whilst, whilst training? Guys, just just if, if you are looking, and this is aimed at the people who are looking to lose weight, okay, we're coming up to that Christmas period where people want to get into those little black dresses or more aimed towards January period, okay, start looking at those, okay, be honest with what you're consuming because you can't bullshit a good trainer. If, you, if a trainer knows what he or she's talking about, okay, they're going to know once they've done your, your uh, nutrition side of things, um, and once on this sort of training program, if something stops, okay, and you're saying you're, you're adhering to it and you're sticking to it, they're going to know you're lying, okay, or there's an underlying medical issue, which then they should really refer you on to go and see someone else, which isn't a large amount of population. Most people, they're just lazy and, and lie about their diet. Um, so guys, we've got our... Um, uh, our results, we've got our video blogs um, pretty much all filmed now, or quite a few of them filmed, um, and we're going to start drip feeding them. This one's a bit off the cuff, okay, so excuse the, the quality, and I'm just sort of talking, I, I, I'm thinking as I'm talking. Um, so, guys, take what you want out of this video, okay, it's not a dig at anyone, and please don't be offended by anything I've said, but if, you, if your fat loss has stalled and your weight loss has stalled, okay, either look at what you're eating, and start eating less, okay, or two, get your ass moving a bit more, okay, guys, if you've got any um, any questions, we'll happily answer them, okay, we'll do them on the video, because we do get asked quite a lot of questions, and I want to start building up a bit of a, a, a catalogue of videos, so we can just point people in the right direction of, of videos, um, and if you've got any uh, questions, uh, that are a bit more specific about training, please drop me a message, okay? Just find me on Facebook um, or the Ultimate Results page. I will answer it as best as I can. And um, yeah, guys, we'll go from there. So um, yeah, pop down to Ultimate Results as well. Come down and see us. Uh, we've got a great team of trainers down there at the moment. Um, if, they've got, if you've got any questions, pop down, ask us questions. We'll sit down and have a coffee with you. And uh, we'll do our best to, um, to get you aiming towards the, uh, the results you want.